Good morning everybody. So we are back with a, another mindfulness talk and the, today's one is in regards to mindful walking. So I know I know um, most people know the benefits of walking from an exercise um, or in a physical health perspective but we're going to go into the more mindfulness aspect of walking today. So walking provides an opportunity to be present, making you aware of your breath, the sensations in your body and your surroundings. Mindful walking is also energizing incorporating and incorporating movement that is easy to practice and can be done almost anywhere and at any time, alone or with others. And if you're an active person, this is a mindfulness practice that can be especially rewarding um, for you as it also combines the advantages and benefits of being in the outdoors. Research has shown that mindful walking helps to reduce stress, improves, improves mind um, psychology and produces endorphins, the feel-good emotion of the brain. It is also, it can also help to produce a sense of satisfaction at having done something good for us. It helps to lessen our fatigue and walking can actually boost your energy levels um, as much as 65%. It can help to strengthen your willpower, especially if you are trying to quit smoking, eating sugar, drinking alcohol, or anything else that requires willpower. It helps you to connect with your body and the regular movement provides an opportunity to feel every sensation within your body so you know exactly what is occurring in your body. Now I know when I was working full time in an office, I was often going for a lunchtime walk and honestly it wasn't so much the exercise as opposed to just getting out and clearing my mind from the morning so then I could focus better on the afternoon. And I still do that now now that I work from, now that I work from home all the time and work for myself now. I still will go out at lunch, at around lunchtime to go for a walk just to help me clear my mind, refocus, check in with myself and just and you know, get some fresh air as well and some vitamin D on the skin and all of that good stuff. So it is something that is so, so simple to incorporate into your daily life. Like, like I said, I did it on my lunch break. I'll just go for a walk. I still do it actually, go for a walk. <laughs> and it just, it really does make that difference between um, in your performance for that afternoon period of your working life. So I do recommend it. Um, to get out there and just it doesn't have to be a long walk it can just be like you know 15 20 minutes that is enough just to help clear the fog and re-engage with yourself to then prepare and then come in prepared for the afternoon so i hope everyone's having a great week and we'll be back next week with another mindfulness talk so chat soon bye